Hi, today we're going to take the review look at Elegant Expressions Smoke and Wolf Insect Burner. This, I believe, was 10 to 12 bucks all the way at Walmart. Now, the insects that it uses are the cone insects, so if you have sticks, it's not going to burn the stick insects. If you have the cone insects, it's going to burn the cone insects. No incense come with this. You must provide your own incense. So, yeah. So, let's see if we can get this on camera here. As you can see. Now, I like how the design matches the actual work, but I wish that it would say cone incense burner. Because you just say incense burner and, you know, people can paint whatever. It could be the sticks, it could be the cone, it could take both, but it doesn't. It only tastes cones. And, like here, it says uh, directions for use. If I could. It's kind of hard to hold this spitter, so. Let's see. Come on. There you go. Directions for use. Light tip of insect and blow out the flame. Always place insect incense on flame proof with place for use with 1.25 inch insect cones. Ah, so they do say insect cones. Not on the front of the tape, only on the back. So there's tape all over here and stuff. So let's take the tape off. I mean, this thing is just kind of beautiful. So, pretty much smoke is supposed to come out of the mouth. Out of both of the ears. Which you really can't see on camera. But there is a little ear hole. Cavity canals in there. And then it's supposed to come out right there. That side of the base. Of this little rock cliff. And then on this side. So it has two, four, five little spots that smoke is supposed to come out of. Pretty much you just twist this and it comes out. So here's where you place a little cone in there. There's where the cones will go. Come on. So yeah, I'm going to be using the Walmart Dragon's Blood Insect Cones. So you get 25 of standard and 15 black faux cones. So, yep. Now I can't tell which one is which, but uh, we'll tell that these in my review. Just place the cone on in there. Let me kind of get the camera down and focus a bit more. There we go. Now this little black little cup holder that I'm going to call it or cone holder. There is a piece of metal. It's tin. Just to let you know while the bottom piece is the same material as this. Not really sure what the material is. Because it uh, doesn't really say. But yeah. Let's try to get this cone to lay up. There we go. So it's a bit finky, but pretty much hold that and try. Getting this in here. Once 
once you've got it in, give it a little twist. And it should have locked it in place. Which, uh, yeah, smell is starting to come out of it. Let's see if we can get. Well, it was coming out of it. Uh, give it a couple more seconds here. I don't know if you can see on camera, but smells coming out of the wood smell. The only downside is not a lot of smoke's going to be coming out of this for the scent or the inside. You're still going to smell the inside, but you're not going to be, you know, seeing the smell as if you actually had like a little cone burner. Like, you know, those little trays type of things. That, your inside, you're going to see it, a lot more smoke. What's this? It's supposed to be a visual effect of having smoke come out of the wolf, but uh, it's not really happening. You could place about two cones in here. Maybe you could squeeze three, but at least two. It's like the mask that I'll put in here. Two cones for the insect cones. But yeah, more than anything, it's more of a decoration than an actual insect burn. But does it function? Yes, it does, but... Let's say, I don't know if you can actually see the smoke come out of the wolf's mouth, but yeah. So that's the review of the smoked and wolf cone insect burner. Remember to hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, hit that notification bell, and leave a comment. Alright, thanks, bye.